Hello everyone and welcome to Night's Adventure. Now today in Night's Adventure I'm going to talk to you guys about some uh, very interesting things that you may find very uh, disturbing at the same time, but it's not disturbing. It's something that uh, we must know right now kind of thing. Even though if you don't know this already, I, this is based off the information that I was given. Alright, I'm just going to repeat some information, but not like a copyright kind of thing. No. It's called, I, I want to learn more about these people. I want to learn more about the 5th density people. <clears throat> the 6th density people and the uh, 7th density people and all and even other density people. That have actually been here before us. Been here before humans. Uh, before we were even made actually into existence kind of thing. So and that's the thing. Uh, and, uh, and that's what I really want to really know about. So, and there is, uh, as it says in the, in the Bible, though, and it actually does say this in the Bible, that there shall be no other gods before me, as God would say. Uh, but there was other gods. There's other gods that still exist, that are right here with us right now. But you have a choice if you want to be with God, or the other ones. There's different choices that you have. And uh, it's just whatever you want to choose. Uh, and it's depending on what you want to be, who you want to be, and like kind of thing. And if you want to be that kind of an evil person, then so be it. And then just uh, live out the life that you want. I'm not gonna sit here and try to stop you for it, I'm, but I would actually stop you from going down the wrong paths. Of course, why not? It's like I, I try to save as many lives as I can really can, and try to help out as many as I can at this point. I'm just that kind of person. I love helping other people as much as I really can, but not uh, all completely selfish or completely in my own self ways. No. I'm not trying to be selfish. I'm not actually trying to share things that actually make sense to share. So if you actually have these different things or you're doing these different hobbies and you would like to do to get into these different hobbies, there's different things that you can do in these hobbies that you can uh, actually add to what you're actually making kind of thing so uh, that's pretty much what that is I, I really do back to the other subject back to the, the, the actual subject uh, that I really uh, legit want to know about those other people I, I really do and I want to know a lot more about the uh, aliens uh, more so about them uh, the almond shaped uh, eyeball ones like uh, they have been seen before the gray ones and uh, of course uh, they want to show themselves uh, to you when they want to but not exactly in this pr uh, present moment I wouldn't want one showing up right now kind of thing that would be uh, creepy at the same time that would be really creepy if one showed up <laughs> just because I'm talking about it uh, but yeah and I wouldn't really doubt that because they can teleport anywhere and they can literally legit teleport right in front of you without you uh, without it being uh, with thin, uh, mid, uh, thin air kind of thing, to where it's like you don't you have to be, uh, don't have to be physically there kind of thing. It can just be like right there in front of you kind of thing. It's a uh, very uh, interesting. Uh, I heard of uh, there are different uh, stories about them and stuff like that. Well, there isn't really that great of uh, good stories that much I heard about them as other ones. Of course not. Because uh, there's a lot of other things that uh, are behind that uh, that we just don't know about quite yet. Uh, but we will uh, figure it out in the near future, or maybe um, uh, I might have to teach us uh, more about these kind of things uh, and teach us humans how to really behave with these kind of things uh, in a different manner. Even though I'm a human myself, but it's a uh, it's a very complicated process between them and us. So it's not a uh, one uh, trip thing kind of thing. No, it's not. Uh, but really, uh, the reality is that I just want to be that better kind of person, uh, just the, the the nicest person that you can just uh, pretty much ever meet to uh, be broadcasted anywhere. Uh, pretty much uh, to be an informational speaker or a motivational speaker kind of thing to uh, be able to get to travel the world and uh, to be able to share stories such great stories and, and inspire more and more other people uh, to uh, really get to so be aware about these kind of things because it's like it's super 
uh, uh, important to really know about these things because they're a part of who we are as well and why we came out to be the way we are and well as it says in the Bible uh, that Adam and Eve and all that kind of stuff yeah of course there is that but then there's other arguable things that they have figured out that is uh, a little bit more arguable than that uh, but uh, yeah there's of course uh, there's that but there's uh, other creations and we were created by him yes and, and according to how the Bible puts it yes we were but uh, the um, it's just there's other gods that play a big role with uh, how we are made as well so like Zeus and Mother Nature uh, they also are uh, gods to be respected even right now uh, and uh, if you don't really know about them they will present themselves to you and if you really want to know them uh, just call out their names and say do you exist and they will actually answer you in, in uh, different voices and stuff so uh, and uh, of course uh, demons they still exist unfortunately uh, that is something I'm trying to fix uh, right now kind of thing. Uh, that is a very complicated thing as uh, as for right now that there's still a huge spiritual war going on uh, and also physical warfare is uh, involved with that too so yikes, uh, there's a lot of work that I pretty much have to do yet uh, but it's uh, not too late to just try to do certain other things try to make it right at least for everyone I uh, try to do things the right way, uh, in all the right ways. Um, among uh, the, just the hobbies I like to do, and especially with making, uh, creating uh, inflatable suits. I love creating them because uh, they make people happy, they really do. And uh, that's what pretty much what I, what I love doing. I love making people happy, it's in my own ways. Uh, and even though that's really creepy to uh, talk about that kind of stuff though, but it's just something that isn't science fiction at all. Uh, that even though we, we think that a lot of people find it, it's like, oh, is this a science fiction kind of thing? No, this is, this is not science fiction here. This is for real kind of stuff. This is stuff that really exists and that's actually uh, really, uh, that's with you even right now, 24-7. It's not something that's going to go every, every single day uh, that passes and you know, go away kind of thing. No, these these gods and uh, goddesses, they stay. And the demons, uh, they stay. They're here. They're very real. And they're, they're something that you do not, you especially don't want to mess with those, those kind of things, the demons. Oh my gosh, they're, they're terrible. I've met them before and they are super terrible. So just do not mess around with them. And, uh, and try not to and if you're getting bothered by them, uh, try to uh, shove them away somewhere else uh, and uh, get God to try to shove them somewhere else. And uh, the other gods can also help you with it too. Uh, and there's uh, other things that can, there's other people that can also help you uh, with these kind of things. So you can always go to uh, different other people that actually have different gifts for these kind of things as well. Or and uh, or you can come to me for some help to get rid of those things. I don't really know how to, exactly how to get rid of them quite yet. Uh, but yeah, I can uh, get rid of these. Try to get rid of these really bad, evil things like that. But if, I don't really want to be really bothered by these kind of things again. So if uh, you're going to try to bring those kind of things over here, yikes! Uh, try not to uh, bring it into uh, the video camera kind of thing. Just try to. Uh, focus on not having that kind of thing or uh, trying to help you as much as I can but there would be no guarantee that things uh, would actually work the way that they should kind of thing. I don't really know exactly what else I can do quite yet. I'm trying to figure out what powers I have, what actual powers I, I really have really uh, and uh, to, to see what else I can actually do uh, to, these, uh, to this dimension realm and uh, making it a better dimension realm of course. The physical dimension realm is uh, just one of the very many dimension realms that we uh, such as live in and uh, we choose to live in this dimension realm right now uh, uh, among the other ones that actually still exist uh, with it and so it's a uh, it's a it's both it's uh, pretty much a both kind of thing 
It's like you feel everything in this dimension realm, and you do feel everything in the other dimension realms as well. So, whatever that happens in this dimension realm also help, it happens in these. It doesn't happen in these other dimension realms, though, uh, because they work in different ways in other different ways. So, yeah, it's a very different uh, world. Uh, there's a lot of different worlds uh, that you can uh, travel to, a lot of different dimensions. But uh, yes, uh, I'd say. Uh, any other additional questions about this really confusing stuff, uh, you can always uh, comment down below. And if you're those kind of people, kind of thing, you're more than welcome to come to this channel. If you're somebody who's like an alien or something like that, you're more than welcome here. Uh, I can, I'll talk to you all day, every day, kind of thing. And uh, of course, if you want to be able to chat with me, then you can. Uh, you can be a video chatter as well. Or if you want to see me in person, that's okay too. Uh, you can see me in person uh, as well, uh, as a, if you're an alien, because uh, they teleport a lot. So they can teleport just right there in front of me, so and that, that doesn't matter, and I welcome them. Uh, it's not like uh, I don't welcome them at all, as long as they're not going to hurt me or anything like that, or anything harmful to me. It's long as they're, they're going to help us all and, and somehow get us uh, to where we need to be kind of thing, then yeah, it's fine. I don't have a, a personal... Uh, a preference of uh, what else, it's how, how certain other things are, kind of thing. It's just things are the way they are right now. It's just uh, it's how some things that are on my hands, and uh, that I cannot help right now with, and then it's on my hands. It's not uh, something I'm going to try worrying about or anything like that. It's something that uh, I, I don't really worry about it too much at all. So it's, it's not something worth worrying about anymore. Uh, it's like uh, I try to live out the life uh, or my life the way I, I'd like to to its fullest and then that's it that's pretty much it and you only live life once and I'm only going to be living my life once anyway so at least this one and, uh, and among uh, this is my only part of my life that uh, actually I can say that uh, it has a lot of great meaning to it and also uh, a great meaning to new beginnings uh, tons of other beginnings and uh, just enough to say uh, but yeah, I'll say see you guys now on my next adventure. Uh, bye.